let me start off by telling you thank you for being a bigger person. Um, I have thought about apologizing to you yesterday because I apologize to nobody. I was personally apologize to you, you know, because more or less I can say major labels directly. There's been so much of love and light on the house in the last 24 hours and I think it's something of joy to see that the house made to move from the whole level of toxicity that happened last week, right? Um, you know, and move into this whole love and light. I mean, yesterday and two days ago, Big Brother brought on a therapist who spoke to the housemates and all of that. And then after that, we started seeing a lot of apologies going around. People started apologizing to each other, talking to each other. And of course, we saw the fact that Perry and of course, Cross made up, right? One of the ones that, you know, I also saw this morning was the fact that Tolini Baj was apologizing to CC after the fight they had after the Sunday Live Eviction show. Remember that Tolini Baj came for CC, calling CC ugly and all of that. And here we see Tolini Baj apologizing to CC, saying, that, you know what, she didn't mean those words. She bottled up a whole lot of things and it, at that moment she just exploded, right? And you could see CC saying, it's okay. I mean, she also understands. I want to apologize for using some really harsh words. You do not deserve it. No, I don't think you're ugly. No, I don't think you're fat. No, I don't think you're all the words that I said. Moving on to my next issue, we saw the fact that Neo wrote a letter to Tony Barge and he read it to her, right? It was a break up letter. Like, guy, I'm not doing it anymore. And I think that, you know, um, that there are a lot of twists and turns happening in the house right now. Why can't you just tell her? But anyway, he chose to write a letter. Now, he read the letter to her and Tolini Baji and Nihu moved to the toilet and she was like, guy, you want to quit me? I'm not quitting you. This relationship must continue. I still, I still want you to be my person, man. I still want to be your person. So Neil says that, you know what, he's tired. He's emotionally tired. He's tired of the whole embarrassment. He didn't come into the house to have a ship and all of that. But of course, he loves what they share in this. But at this point, it looks like he's just, he's just going to drop all of this off and then keep it moving. But Tony Badge is insisting that, you know, it is one of the relationship problems that people will have in life. We're going to get through this over time. And then after that, we literally saw both of them sitting on the toilet seat and they were kissing. One thing that I know is this, Neo is not firm. He's not standing his ground. I mean, if you want to break up, break up and move. When you break up, you know, with someone, you still don't think that you keep moving, you move away from them, right? Probably move into the company of another person. I know it's a big brother's house, it's secluded and all of that. Move on to someone else, right? If you've broken up, go to Ilibaye and let's see what happens, right? But of course, I mean, you've broken up with your kissing. Well, we're going to see how this plays out in the long run. Moving on to my next gist, Lucy has told me brother she doesn't want to leave the house anymore. I mean, I like that. The fact that, you know, she's had to rethink, saying that, you know what, um, she's thought about it, and then she feels she wants to stay back in the house. Also, as part of the whole apologies that happened, we saw the fact that, you know, she apologized to Ilebae for calling her different kind of names, different sort of names, and of course, for the words, the downgrading and demeaning words he said about women, you know, and it was, you know, sincerely apologizing, right? I can see Lee by looking at him. I think the entry of the four housemates has brought a bit of light. I think these people have seen what's happening outside. And one of the things they've asked them to probably do is to try to tone down the whole level of toxicity, right? My thoughts, you know, I know they also had to play the game and win some tasks and all of that. But I think that, you know, these people coming in has, you know, lightened up the house. Because yesterday, Cece was telling me that, these people coming to the houses, change the atmosphere in the houses, brighten it up. No, he wasn't seeing that anyways. I don't know what he was seeing. He was like, hey, really? Are you sure these people came to the house and the atmosphere changed? But I personally also think that the atmosphere is changed on the house. And we're going to see how this is going to last. Remember that tomorrow is a wager tax presentation. And we're going to see if you're going to win the wager for this week. Guys, thanks so much guys for watching. Please go to the comment section. Let me know what you think. Please, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. Turn on your notification bells. And guess what? You get notified whenever I post a video. Go on all social media platforms on Facebook and Instagram, on Twitter, and of course on TikTok. And follow me at Femi Daniel. And until next time, I come away again very soon. It's bye for now.